Hopefully, everything will improve now. Now leave me alone. I've got a headache. Hey, this is private property. It'd be better for you if you hauled your ass back off to the tavern. Bet they've got a whore and some cool beer ready for you. Private property bullshit. It's true. Got a deed. Really? Where? In my ass. We better get out of here before we wake up the dead with our talk. It's not exactly safe to chat here. You're not a member of a gang of looters by any chance, are you? <laughs> Just because I poke my fingers here and there into an old pile of rubble? It's hardly forbidden. No, I'm an honourable guy. Where do you think would be safe? I know a good hiding spot right near here. You'd be safe there, and you wouldn't run the risk of ending up at some creature's dinner. Why aren't you in the tavern? I'm not really the type to gossip. Well... What happens to you shouldn't really be my concern anyway. I just mean well for you. Take me there. All right. I'm sure I've also got something for you to eat. I'd hate for people to think I don't have manners. Right, we're almost there. Just a little further. You didn't have to stop to tell me that. All right, I thought that you might be feeling faint. Let's go then. Stay behind me. We're there, nice and remote. And the best thing is, nobody will hear you scream. Why am I not surprised? Still got a big mouth, huh? But I've gagged other loud mouths like you. You wouldn't be in this mess if you'd hauled your ass back to the tavern. Now draw your weapon, weakly. I'll teach you. <laughs> 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 something that looks like a hardened crab shell. I've got it already. your own fucking business.
humanity. Thank you for your help. You shouldn't have come here. Stop talking shit. You've discovered my ritual site. But you won't have time to tell anyone about it. Say hello to the dead for me. You're done for. <laughs> what I found. Hey! I know that tome. Mick was always leafy through it. I always thought it was a bit fishy. He could hardly read. Strange. You can take Mick off your guest list. <laughs> he was never on it. He never had a penny to his name. Does that mean he's... Uh... Yes. Oh, I hate to say this, but he's no loss. think of this part of the world. The demon hunters have seen the way things are going and want to negotiate. But their power alone won't be enough to stop death. What do I do with this black heart now? Like I said, show it to a shaman. Only they know how to ease your suffering with it. Until then, keep collecting black hearts. You'll need them. The shamans used a black heart on you? Yes, they used a few of them. I even kept one just in case. You still have one of them? Where? Uh, listen, I, I may still need it. Come on, where is it? I hid it in a chest. It's a secret location on Takarigua. I'll show it to you on your map. And here's the key as well. Satisfied? Come on, let's go. Of course.
There's no end to these foul creatures. You're never getting up again, you damn shadow.
Come on, let's go. Sure. I can only brew the potion when you have all the ingredients. I don't know anything about you, do They're rebuilding us. It's bloody. You rotten scrout. I'm busy right now. We'll do as Alvarez commands. Pirate's honor. Show me. No problem. Can't do something like Have that. Have you noticed a strange looking book around here anywhere? Well, now that the hellhounds aren't bothering us anymore, I can think about it. Yes, I've seen a book like that. Where did you see it? At my place. Will you give it to me? No. Those books can drive you mad. If you say so. You really should give it to me. 
Forget it. Enough of playing games. Fine. If you're just gonna keep on about it, you can at least help me. What do you need my help with? I plan to perform an incantation from that book. You really shouldn't do that. But I'm going to. So will you help me or not? Have you realized that we could tame every animal? We could even teach monkeys to juggle. So I thought to myself, what if I could manage to tame a shadow? That sounds like the dumbest idea I've ever fucking heard. Maybe, but maybe not. That's why I want to have you there when I try to cast a spell on one of those beasts. In case something goes wrong. I'll help you with the incantation. All right. This is what we're gonna do. We'll meet at this exact spot. Then we'll head to my ritual site. Then I'll read from the book, and we'll try to conjure a shadow. And what do I do? You will stay out of it entirely until I finish the incantation. If I do it right, a shadow should appear. We'll knock it out and train it. That's your plan. Yep. That plan is even dumber than I thought. Tell me when you're ready. Let's go to the Ritual Square. Come back tonight. The Ritual will only work when it's dark. I'm busy, right? Uh, this... What are you doing there? What's going on here? Let's see what you've got. So what will it be? Why are you here? You're going to get into trouble sooner or later. I've been stuck in Spencer's den for 16 days, looking for the guy who stole my glass eye. Just last night, he was watching me carefully, telling tales of a cave full of spiders on Keela. Crap. I can't aim properly without my eye. Hmm. A cave full of spiders. Oh, what are you doing there? I hate headaches. Ah, oh, that hurt. I'll be all right. I hope you know how to behave as a guest.
Let me go to the forge. About Wilson. Wilson asked me to give you this. Oh, are you serious? I would never have expected that of him. Oh, he's such a charmer. Wilson got your letter. At least you men are good for something. Yeah, amazing, isn't it? Now, hand over your gold. Well, you don't beat about the bush. Show me your goods. stuff. Sure. Here. We need the support of the other communities. Only when we have gathered enough combat strength in our harbor will we be able to defy Crow. His mountain of debt drove him on his last night when he... Mm.
some things to do here. I still have some things to do here. A human spirit. Hello? And he speaks to me with no fear. Should I be afraid of you? Hmm. You have no idea who stands before you? Um... I am Ursagor. Titan Lord and Master of the Land and the Elements. Who are you?
I'm fighting for the last free people of the Southern Seas. The Southern Seas, you say? Hmm, interesting. Then you are the drifting soul who is challenging the shadows. I have heard of you. It seems you have great potential for a human. If you're really the Titan Lord Esagor, then you're partly responsible for the destruction of our world. We were at war. Oh yeah. Thanks to your Titan War, thousands have died, and the land in the north has been devastated. Sacrifices were necessary. Greater goal? What sort of lunacy is that? Hmm. I see you don't have much left, except your courage. Help me. I want my life back. You don't need my help, Drifting Soul. You can move freely here in the underworld, and in the world of the living. That gives you great power. You just have to learn how to use it. I will keep an eye on you. If what they say about you is true, then I'm sure we will meet again soon. Until then, remain vigilant. Hey, wait a moment. Do as Alvarez commands. Pirate's honor. Is there someone there? And the remedy? I have the ingredients you wanted. Thank you. I'll begin right away. I believe the potion is working. It will take a while until I'm fully recovered. Take this as a reward. Feel free to browse my wares. What have you got? See for yourself. Thing 
bastard! Oh. Something about a tuning fork. I've already. Let's go to the Ritual Square. All right, follow me. I'm gonna start now. Uh Gaffer Gaha Raf Dalga Kralaf Gin Grafen I can't read that. Raflarna Flaranga Flaranga who the hell is supposed to read and understand this? Clear fucker! Rat Ah, screw this! And finally, Fire Titan's toenail in the mouth. Shit!
Here, soul dust for humanity. Come on, let's go. All right. It's good to see you. Don't you have work to do? Don't be made to look a fool. I have a plan. Let's hear it, lad. I was a pirate captain before I came here. Oh, yeah? Eldrick sent me on a mission to save us from the shadows. Oh. Admiral Alvarez wants to build a fleet in Antigua. All the ships of the Southern Seas have been summoned to report to him there. We should join him. I know our enemy on the high seas. His name is Crow. And he's a ghost. I see. Huh. Eldrick and the pirates are on your side, you say? All right, lad. You've almost convinced me. But one question. Two captains is one too many. So, who's gonna command the ship? You may be a good field commander, but you're no sailor. All right then, sailor boy. The frigate is yours. But under one condition, I'll be at your side to keep an eye on you. Welcome aboard, Captain. What have I got myself into? Are you already doubting your decision? No, but... Well, that's to be seen. But remember, I'm not used to others giving me orders. So tread carefully. I'll bear that in mind. See that you do. Good hunting. But don't forget, I've got my eye on you. Watch your back, lad. Impressive. I never thought someone like you would command such a ship. Well, in which case we're lucky that you were wrong, aren't we? Our biggest battle is still ahead of us. Let's hope this ship of yours survives it.
soul dust for humanity. Here, yeah. soul dust for humanity. Shadow is moving through the water somewhere off the coast. They say it was bigger than a ship. What could it be? I don't know, but I'm afraid it'll be too late to ask questions when it attacks. So be careful and prepare to be ambushed when you set sail. You should speak to your crew. Go safe! Hey, where did you come from? Right. Well then, welcome on board. Go safe! Go, 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 go safe! Fuck! Fuck! Come on, let's go. Of course! Don't be made to look a fool. Don't you have work today? I've heard a lot of good things about you recently. They say you're a man of honor. Keep it up, and mankind may be able to hope again. Don't worry. The crystal portal on Antigua is closed. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. There's nothing more to fear from the North. That's a weight off my mind, my boy. That must be worth a few gold to you, right? Of course. Here's your share of the town's glory. If things continue like this, we will experience a glorious new age. A word about the Pirate Alliance. Go ahead. The Demon Hunters of Kalidor are with us. Demon Hunters? Hmm. And you think they will help us? They have extensive knowledge of the Titan Lords. Hmm. Kalidor. I've never heard of them. They can be very persuasive and have some powerful warriors. Hmm. I can see you've even aligned yourself with them. Well, if you think they're strong enough to advance our cause, then so be it. Here's some gold to supply the troops on the Demon Hunter ship.
Damn, that was big! Sea monster. Here, in the southern seas. They're usually much further south. I suspect that they may have been driven here by someone. By the Ghost Captain Crow? Possibly. We'd do well to keep an eye on the water. That's probably not the last monster we'll see. Come on, let's go. Yes. The marauders won't cause any more problems. Hmm. I hope in future those vultures give the Iron Bay a wide berth. Good thing you tackle a problem head on. Here, this is for you. The power of our forefathers flows in us. The spirits got me. Oh, bollocks. Well, I guess that's it for my experiment. Thanks for trying anyway. Here's some gold. Take care. I don't have time to chat. Back to work. About Grace. Grace received your engagement ring. And? How did she react? She was overjoyed. I think she misses you. Really? Oh, yes. When my work here is complete, I'm going back. I wouldn't be in such a hurry if I were you. Oh, she has her good sides, believe me. Before you go, here, take the diamond grinder. I'm a man of my word. Thanks. I wouldn't have moved from this spot without it. Yeah, I know. A deal's a deal. Precisely. I don't have enough. The shadows will fall. I'd like to carry out a mental grip spell. That spell was a good choice. Don't be made to look a fool. It's good to see you. Come on, let's go. Yeah! Hey! 
you hear that? Um, no. What do you hear? Those voices. Sure you can't hear them. Well... Never mind. I was probably just hearing things. If you want to come to our pirate's den, head towards the old wreck down in the south. I'm sure we can spare you a proper shop at a rum. Rum sounds perfect. Yeah? In which case, I'm sure you'll have great fun with us. Oh, right, and watch out for that warrior by the name of Borbor. That native has been watching our camp for days now. Where is this warrior? He's somewhere on the path to the jungle towards the southwest. Don't let him cast a spell on you, you hear me? Those native warriors are known for the use of voodoo and that sort of hocus pocus. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Right. <clears throat> there. There are those voices again. Or not. Interesting shipwreck. I wonder how many sea miles it's traveled. Hey, you there. You've got no business here. Says who? Says me. And I'm the boss around here. Without me, people here will be dying of thirst. So you're going to do as I say. Don't fuck with me. You want your ass kicked. Hey, just just calm down, all right? I was just showing off a bit. Here, you, you can have my rum ration. So... Put your fist down, okay? Don't lay it on so thick next time. Hmm. Yeah. You're probably right. Soon we won't have any fresh water left here anyway. And then we'll all be at each other's throats. I have the answer. Less water. More rum. Um, I don't want to offend you, but you know how rum is made, right? Without access to the only water source here on Keela, we've had it. No water, no rum, no nothing. How good are you with a knife? Hey, easy there, all right? I don't want any trouble. I fucking meant how good are you at throwing a knife? All right. Why don't you say so in the first place? I'd say I'm okay at it. I practice every day at noon at the throwing board. You can challenge me if you like. Why can't you get to the water? Because we always get a spear in the arse if we get too close to the waterfall. The natives here don't do sharing. Make them an offer they can't refuse. Sure. And what might that be? You're a pirate. A thrashing always works. Have you seen how strong their tonkers are? They beat you to a pulp. It's not going to work. Can't you help me? I could really do with a hand here. Do the others know you'll soon run out of water? Are you crazy? I might as well dig my own grave. When Booze realizes we're about to run dry, he'll string me up for sure. Nobody trusts anyone here as far as they can throw them, so keep your mouth shut. Teach me something. What do I know? I'm only interested in my barrels. Unless you have gold. Then I'm the person to speak to. Where is the water source? Go further inland. Keep southwest until you encounter a waterfall. Just watch out for the natives. Relax. I'll get you water. Ah, oh, thanks. That would be great. Teach me. Only if the price is right. Teach me how to improve my lock picking skills. No one else can teach you how to pick locks better than me. You've become one of the best I know. I'd like to become a better thief. Your pickpocket skills are second to none. And there's nothing else I or anyone else can teach you. You could almost best the gnomes. What do you sell? Hey. 
What are you doing skulking around here? I don't like people snooping around behind my back. I'm the guy who's supposed to collect all the gold around here. Ha! <laughs> the last person who tried to collect gold from us was hanged. He lasted three days before the crows got to him. Anyway, it reminds me of that time on Takarigura. Everything was blazing away and then boom! The cauldron exploded. Everything was reduced to black ashes. And it was Patty's fault alone. Damn witch! Good lord, what did he have for breakfast? No idea, but I don't want any. What's the matter with you? With me? Nothing. The others are to blame for everything. First Patty wants to kill us all, and then Harry mutinies. Bloody ungrateful scum, turning their backs on me, killing my men. But this gang won't be laughing for much longer. All right, just calm down. Or well, maybe you're in cahoots with them too. I'm warning you, nobody does the dirty on me that easily. Where can I find Patty? She was a coward and fled before I could bring her to justice. Ah, she escaped my clutches, the wretch. There's only one place around here where they could have hidden themselves. There's a small island to the north. Search there. Buddy has a few problems getting water. What? That's his responsibility. That the thanks I'm getting for always coming to his defense. But anyway, when the time comes, I'll cut his water ration first. What's your problem with Harry? That treacherous dog. Calm down, will you? Why don't you distill a barrel of rum and then all get completely rat assed Yeah, good idea. That's what I was thinking. I wanted to distill some very special rum, but then... Guess who I sent to gather the ingredients and who didn't come back? Harry the sneaky bastard. You know what? You're going to pay him a visit and fetch the delivery for me. And then we'll have a little party with all our friends here and get drunk until nobody can stand up anymore. What do you think? I'll talk to Harry. Very good. Get that delivery here. And hurry! What? Do I... Can't you see I'm having a conversation? You can jolly well wait till I'm done. What? Do I see the end? Of course I see it. Do you also see the black mist above the water? Hmm. No. That's fine then. Sadek just sees an illusion. That's probably the rum. No. No wrong images, Gucho. Sadek can see. Sadek sees the other side. Rum is only for the mind. You can really put it away, my friend. Rum is healthy and dispels evil spirits. Well, when you put it that way... What do you mean by other side? Here, drink this, and you will understand. With this, you'll see the world through the eyes of a true warrior. All you need for defeating your opponent is right before your eyes. Oh, really? Only the right stuff will stir up your senses, Gucho. I could use someone like you on my crew. You seem to know a lot about potions. Sadek would like nothing more than to sail to sea again. But Sadek must stay. Booze needs Sadek here. Sadek has much to thank Booze for. Booze saved Sadek's life. Now Booze is having a hard time. His spirit is in a fog. Sadek cannot leave Booze until Booze sees clearly again. Booze isn't quite with it. Gee. That's why Sadek stays until Booze can see clearly again. What? Do I see the end? Of course I see it. Death is... It's already taken, Douglas. And it's only a matter of time. But you don't think in all seriousness that he'll be satisfied with Douglas's sacrifice? Bloody Harry!
What do you sell? Let's throw knives. All right. Are you getting no money from me? And what's your wager? A very special item. A monocle. A monocle? Yes. I'm telling you. Anyone who carries it sees things more clearly. On your marks, get set, go. Let's go! Ha-ha! I'm out of here! <laughs> well, you win some, you lose some. Wow, a full score. Not bad. Oh, shit. Hey, I finally found something I can do well. Why don't you try again later? Look at what the floodwaters brought in. Another fucking weirdo. I hope you have gold in your pockets. Interested in doing some business? What kind of business are we talking about? Ah, I see you know how to grab an opportunity when you see one. Listen, I'm looking for someone who can get me something. Let me guess. That someone is me. Well, you seem well-traveled. And the task is a no-brainer for someone like you. All you have to do is go to Antigua, find my brother Flynn, and remind him of my inheritance. Why didn't you remind your brother of the inheritance? Never got round to it. It's a long trip after all. Are you scared of long journeys? Shut up. I'm not afraid. I don't need to be afraid. I bet I can teach you a few things. About the inheritance. I ran into your brother Flynn on Antigua. Your inheritance wouldn't happen to be a sword fragment, would it? Damn, so you know about that. I'll make you a deal. You get me his sword fragment and I'll reward you appropriately. All right. But I warn you, don't try to fuck me over. What do you think I am? I'm an honest pirate. I hope so, for your sake. Do you do anything else besides shady dealings? I pass the time throwing knives. 
It frightens the rats away. Right. I always train late at night, until after midnight. If ever you fancy a game, let me know. I always like throwing for a few coins. What can you teach me? That depends. Show me how to improve my dagger skill. No problem. Your new skill will come in handy. Show me how to improve my dagger skill. You should always hone your skills. Show me how to improve my dagger skill. No problem. Your new skill will come in handy. Let's trade. All right. 